Hi guys, Naresh here. I'm from Clever Studies YouTube channel, working as a senior data engineer in one of the MNC company. Guys, this video is especially for big data aspirants, okay? You know, I used to get many messages, calls or emails. It is very difficult to answer each and every person. I'm already working. I don't get much free time, but still in my free time, I will try to uh, share my knowledge. On top of it, I'm getting a lot of calls or messages directly. Uh, which is really you know time taking process to uh, give answers to you right I thought to create a video and address some of the common common questions or a common doubts which I am getting from the you know audience so that is the purpose of the video and definitely this is uh, very much useful for you also so please watch till end so I noticed common questions that I am receiving to our uh, friends like uh, I know theoretical knowledge, but I don't have a real-time project experience. Uh, I'm I'm not able to crack an interview because of this experience. So what to do? And this is one question. And the second question is, they required some tech, uh, technical uh, course, uh, let us say PySpark or, or Databricks or uh, some other tool which uh, really required to enter into a software industry from non-IT to IT or from IT different department to a, a data domain. And these kind of questions, what are the tips and tricks to gain a job? So I have a gap, uh, how to fill that gap. I'm working in a different company, which is non-IT, then how to convert non-IT experience into IT. We all know, and during 2020-2021 Corona pandemic, right? Those guys who already have a more than five year experience, definitely they have a real time experience. That means going to office and working with the colleagues and uh, executing the project in live mode, they know very well. But those guys who got the offer letter and joined the company or not joined the company, I'm sure more than 50% guys definitely did not get the chance, right? They know only work independently, not as a group, right? Because of this situation, we are not blaming anyone because it is due to a COVID pandemic, right? But here there is a catch. Of course, nowadays uh, companies are calling us uh, a hybrid model that we have to go and work. Yes, that is good, my my opinion. And uh, major the project now uh, are doing in Agile methodology and sprint based. So what I noticed uh, from majority of the team, which I'm getting calls is that they don't know how a data engineer will work company for the projects. Without that, though you have a technical knowledge, somehow you got it from YouTube channels or from internet, when you go and attempt any interview, if an interview asks you one real-time question, like what is your sprint size, what is your team size, how, where, you, where you write your code, how you commit your code, how you push your code, how you get a pull request, okay? how to deploy a code, uh, let us say Databricks code into production, ADF pipelines into production, through GitHub or Azure GitHub and how you connect Databricks and ADF. How, how you connect ADF and ADLS Gen2. You may have uh, some theoretical knowledge on the copy activity or some uh, for loop or metadata lookup. But if an interviewer asks you this it's kind of a real time questions, it is really tricky to answer if you didn't execute your project your own right if you execute a project along with the, your team i'm sure that is the actual real-time experience that you are going to gain okay let's assume you have a good experience and you got a very good knowledge by going through the tutorials or a videos in a internet and somehow you crack the interview okay of course you might claim that i'm a two years or three years four years experience guy okay what if after joining a company if see they may be under perception that you are a two to three years experience guy right if they assign work from the day one what is your feeling if they come and ask you have you updated your radio board have you created your branch have you sent it for review by creating a pull request have you attended a sprint calls if so, what are the topics that you generally talk in the sprint calls or what is the sprint retrospective? So these and that questions are real time questions. Generally, you won't get it from the internet, right? So if you are a fresher, if you don't want to climb any experience, it is fine. Nobody will ask you or a campus placement. 
But coming to a data engineer, if you are trying to uh, claim yourself as a three to five years experience, then real time experience is mandatory, right? So I strongly suggest one thing for you all, please invest some money on you. You are aware that we invest so much money on many useless things. I don't want to comment, okay, that you know very well. Not only Mali, I'm talking about the effort also. Let us assume you have a only theoretical knowledge, don't have a practical knowledge. Somehow you surf internet and got some course and you completed it uh, in two to three months. Later you notice that that didn't add any value to your life. Then what you will do? Again, you start searching, right? Like this, you don't know wh what is the good material, what is the bad material and what is useful, what is not useful, what is the really important at that moment to get a job and do a work, right? You may not know until unless you get experience. Once you realize that point, then by the time you, you would have already wasted a valuable your time. Let us assume you got a package of 60,000 per month net. What is per day? It is 2,000, right? So you have invested your money, let us say 10,000, 20,000, 30,000 based on the course fee outside and invested your time also. Let us say two months. That means 60,000 is your package, that is per day 2,000 and 20,000 is a course fees. That is 80,000 you invested for two months and realized that you didn't get a insights. You didn't get a what you are expecting. That is what you are, you know, you are feeling after completing that course. Then you tell me who lost, who gained. Whoever is giving a coaching, they are gaining. But you are losing. I'm not saying those guys mistake. No. Due to inexperience, we have chosen that course, which is not really suitable for us at that moment. So here, mentorship is very important. It not only saves your time, it also saves your cost and effort. So choosing a right person, choosing a right path, choosing a right material, choosing at a right time is very important to get a job. So why I'm saying all the stories because me and my team are really working in MNCs and doing project in real time. Not only one project. I have an experience in multiple projects. I worked on waterfall methodologies and also Agile methodology. I worked on non-cloud and now working on a cloud. I know some differences. Being an interviewer, I know what are all very important, where we have to stretch without wasting our time and effort and money. Interest of people, we came up with a project that is very simple. You know, I'm sure once you complete this project by your own, you definitely get a full confidence that yes, I did a, a project. You can present like as usual a real time data engineer present in interviews. This is not a promotional video. I'm not promoting my course because I don't, I don't get lost, right? Because many people already enrolled. Even if you don't enroll, I won't uh, miss anything, but you may miss something, right? This small amount you will earn in a day if you get a job. If you are sitting ideal, not cracking an interview per day, definitely you are losing minimum 1000 to 2000 rupees if you are a three to four years experience guy. So guys, you know, right? I already announced a real time project and which is starting from 4th November and uh, the duration is one month. And moreover, try to understand when you talk to us directly in the call, that makes a lot of difference. Your lot of questions will be cleared out. Have you noticed any of the other channels who given you this kind of opportunity working a real time like a project in our company, we have let us say 20 people who execute a project, treating that project as a real time project and executing together by dividing into groups. So though it is a short term project, you will feel that is a real time project that you executed along with the team. See, some of people may thinking that uh, recorded videos also get in a YouTube. Yes, you may be correct for some cost, but what you lose is you may gain, let us say, you may gain 50% instead of joining the live course. But what you lose is interacting with the people. What if you get a doubts during watching the videos, recorded videos? Who will clarify your doubts? 
if you purchase a, a personally you have to work your own if you get your any doubt nobody will clarify you and you you won't get that feel uh, work as a team right but here when you join this we are dividing into groups you communicate each member whenever it is necessary guys i'm telling you executing means we will execute in front of you by explaining step by step you just go to that recorded video and replicate the same process in your machine and come back if you have any questions you can discuss within the team or you can discuss with us directly during our sessions try to utilize and get benefit out of it don't lose this opportunity okay guys thank you so much if you need what is this course and what is this project course uh, introductory video enrollment form in the video description and enroll if you are interested all the best thank you so much